So let's talk about these items that I make sure I always have in my gear bag whenever I'm out taking photos or videos. The first one is an SD card holder. I have a little one like this and then I have a waterproof one that I also have, and all these items will be listed in the description below if you wanna check them out. They're really easy to use, they just go in like that. So we have SD cards, we have some micros. For those of you Canon guys using the big cards, they have other ones out there. And a cool thing I like to do is once I have a card filled up, I just flip it and put it in so I know that that one's full while I'm out shooting. So definitely need to have one of these. Now another item that I love having and it makes my life so much easier when I'm going from like my gimbal to my tripod is this quick release plate right here. All you do is lift it off and now you can have a couple of these. They're like, I think 10 to $15 and they literally just go right on and they clip on. So if you wanna go from a gimbal to a tripod to a, you know anything, you just use these, makes your life so much easier, especially when you're balancing your gimbal and you tend to use the same lens. All you need is this, you don't have to rebalance it ever. So this is really cool. I have a bunch of them on that shelf back there. So you might wanna check these out. Now the next item on my list are these gear ties. They're, there's two different sizes and they're reusable and it just helps me tie down like wires from my monitor or from my remote because the cable's so long. These just help out. They're really cheap. They're once again like 10 bucks and you can use them in different ways just to keep your cables from getting loose or snagged on something and making your camera fall, which is the worst thing that can happen. It's happened to me. I actually broke a lens, so yeah, these help a ton. Now for the next item is a multi-tool, something like this that has a bunch of different stuff on it as a flathead phillips head as the most common allen keys used and it has a little led light right there so this thing comes in handy all the time i used to use like a quarter to tie down like my plates or to tighten something up and i could never really get a good grip on it so this tool right here is been my go-to a lifesaver in my backpack and i always make sure to have it on me now the next couple items keep debris off your lens i know in my past videos i've shown you guys this before but it's a rocket blower this gets the dust off i've been in some like desert elements or super dusty elements and one thing i can't stand is getting that crap on my lens especially when you're shooting like f5 or higher you notice those particles on your lens in post and it's a pain another thing i like to use are these zeiss wipes right here and it's probably blown out right there so these wipes i wipe down my lens hit it with the blower and it keeps my lens nice and clean the wipes i think you could get like 200 of them for 14 bucks the blower i think is like anywhere from 7 to 15 depending on if you're feeling fancy this guy right here is super cheap i mean it does its job it blows air and then another thing i like to have on me when i can't use the wipes is a microfiber cloth cleaning kit and some solution it comes in a three pack really cheap 10 bucks this stuff works great i even use them on like my sunglasses my phone screen my laptop screen behind me so this stuff comes in handy all the time to keep your lens clean now another item that you guys probably aren't going to expect but i wouldn't carry on me in my wallet or my backpack are having business cards have your business cards on you there's been so many times that i have been out and about and didn't have these on me and people would be like hey you do photo and video do you have a card on you and i'd just be like uh yeah the, i'm getting new ones made like i wouldn't know what to say so i always chuck a bunch of these in my wallet when i'm going to an event always have them on me and also extra ones in my gear bag because you never know when someone's going to want your card to have you work for them in the future so i used vistaprint and if you go on their website or search online there are a ton of promo codes i think i had like 500 made for like 30 bucks and that's with like my custom picture of a drone shot that i took on the front and all my information my handles my email my phone number on the back so that stuff is super important and it looks professional so make sure you have your cards in your gear bag now another item that has saved my life so many times is an external battery pack 
Now this one right here has a bunch of different ports on it. It's 1200 MOS, so I can charge my phone, I think like two to three full times. I could charge the camera if I ever need to. I mean, there's been times where I've been out in the desert or in a cave or somewhere and my phone was dying or my camera was dying. So this thing has been a lifesaver. These could be a little pricey depending on the size that you get, but the bigger the size, the more power you have. So if you're going camping or on a hike, you might need this this thing is awesome i don't know where i would be without it so for the next item on the list are these mikey extension tubes that change any lens into a macro lens now they're really simple to use and you can do a 10 mil or 16 mil on them or you could stack them and get some really tight pictures and some crazy b-roll you could get some awesome macro shots with these and a lot of people overlook the macro shot but whether you're taking pictures of insects or something super detailed like a diamond ring at a wedding or some b-roll of just something super super detailed these come in handy and i'll link these in the description below as well 26 bucks so you my 55 mil with this thing crushes it it is crazy how close i can get to a subject and get some really cool pictures i mean these things if it wasn't for daniel schiffer showing these on his youtube channel and what he could do with these i would have never known about them and they have them for all the different cameras these are the sony e-mounts right here pick them up best investment ever so for the next item that we have here is gaffer's tape now for those of you who have never worked in the film industry this stuff is non-residue leaving tape and it's very easy to use whether you, you never know when you need tape to hold something down and in the film industry i mean everyone always has this on them it's it's just a go-to i love this stuff i mean you could tape down wires on the floor you could tape down wires or i mean what have i used this for i've used this to oh okay so we're back so i even use gaffer's tape on my zion crane because this stuff likes to bang around and whatnot and i don't want to get it scratched up i put it around all the edges and shout out to tam he's an awesome dp homie of mine he showed me this on his crane too and it saves like the the the, the gimbal from pretty much getting scratched up so there's so many uses for gaffers tape i really suggest you guys checking that stuff out it's cheap a giant roll like this big is like 14 bucks so you guys might want to have that on you now the next item i always make sure to have in my gear bag is a headlamp for those of you who haven't checked out my milky way tutorial i'll put it right up here but i use the headlamp anytime i know i might be in a dark situation where i need some extra light i'm shooting sunset and i have to walk back to my car this thing 14 bucks super bright has a bunch of different modes on it always have it you never know when you need some extra light and the iphone just doesn't cut it and wrapping up today's video is the last item $14 for this remote. You can do time lapses, hyper lapses. I did a walking gimbal hyper lapse right up here using this remote. A lot of cameras these days may or may not have a time lapse feature. So you never know when you want to just be able to trigger the camera using an intervalometer. So these things super helpful. There's been times where I didn't have it on me and I decided to do a time lapse and I couldn't because I didn't have it on me. So this thing definitely make sure you pick it up and that wraps up today's video i just want to give you guys some cheap accessories that you never know you might need that i feel like you guys should have in your gear bag my name is jason anthony guys thank you so much for checking out today's video check out my instagram if you have any questions you can always hit me up on there i love chatting with you guys until next time peace